Hey babies, welcome to Dinah Spot. Today I want to do a review on Volatarian Gel. I used to get this on a script paid for by Medicaid. Now you can get it over the counter at the drugstore. This is a great little gel for people who suffer from minor arthritis pain. This really, really helps. Now let's be honest about it and let's really deal with the issues. With me, I suffer from chronic pain. Fibromyalgia is chronic pain. Rheumatoid arthritis is chronic pain. Osteoarthritis is normal wear and tear. So what do I what am I saying? What do I mean? Osteoarthritis comes when the bones and the knees get to rubbing together because there's no padding in the middle because it's been worn down because you have carried many children in your life and you have carried many bags of laundry and many grocery bags and you've picked up many of furniture or you've moved many of furniture that was ha really too heavy for you and you've gotten on your knees and you scrubbed the floors and you've gotten on your knees and scrubbed the bottom of the walls and you gotten on your knees giving head, if that's what you do. But you gotten on your knees. You know, so after a while, your knees just give out on you. That's just what it is. And that is osteoarthritis pain. Now, my pain in my feet is not as bad as the pain in my knees. So when I'm just having a day where I've been on my feet too long, I can rub some of this voluntary and gel on my feet and it's like glory. When I first started my arthritis journey, voluntary and gel really worked for me. And that might have been like maybe two, three months. Then it got to a point where it didn't work for me. Then I wound up getting some prescription compound cream. And the Voluntarian Gel and the compound cream worked great together. That was at the beginning of my arthritis journey. Now, I'm in constant pain. I have the pain from my shoulders all the way down my back. That's the fibromyalgia pain. And you feel drained all the time. Like, oh my God, where is my energy? And, you know, it just, it's a pain that is just really undescribable. It's hard to sleep. I, I, I suffer from sleep apnea and insomnia. I don't get no sleep. As long as that pain is kicking, I don't get no sleep. So then we got the rheumatoid arthritis. The rheumatoid arthritis makes anything on your body swell. So sometimes my feet swell. I mean, swell to a point that the shoes that I already buy, buy 11 wide. And um, my feet just swell. Sometimes my feet be tight in those shoes. Shouldn't be, but they be tight. Sometimes my foreleg swells. Usually that means it's a blood clot traveling through my veins and it's too big for my veins, so it bursts. It's on its way to bursting, but it didn't burst quite yet, or it just bursts. 
in your hands, it make your hands swell. Like, you can't even see your knuckles no more. I mean, it's just, it's really a lot. Rheumatoid arthritis makes you develop some things that you wouldn't normally develop. For me, it made knots on my thyroid. So I told him to cut my neck open and take the thyroid out and take all the naturals with it. I got them up in my nose, too. I asked the doctor to cut them out, and he said, it's no, I can't guarantee you if I cut them out, if it'll grow back. Rheumatoid arthritis strips you out of anything that's going to fight for you to make it better for you and your body. It just drains it all out. So, I have a multitude of chronic pains. And what I do now, and I'm be honest with you, I stopped using Palatarian gel for a long time. And then I started using it again, and it worked for me. So I guess it depends on what your body is getting used to. To make this gel work now, I get me some black seed oil and I'll put a dropper in it and I'll drop it down and drink it. And I'll also put it on my body after I take me a shower or a bath. As soon as I get out while my skin is damp, I'll put that black seed oil on. I'll put some CBD oil, not a lot because the bottle I get is so little. Can't complain. <laughs> it's a gift. So I'll drop a little bit of the CBD oil on top. Once that's rubbed in, I will squirt out a whole bunch of voluntary gel. And I'll rub it all over the sore parts of my foot, which is like my toes, the ball of my foot, and the top. And my ankles, my heels don't be too bad. I don't know why. But I'll slather my body with this. I mean, I'll slather so much on it you think I'm trying to take a bath. <laughs> and I'll rub me some CBD oil, uh, cream, CBD cream. I already rubbed the oil in. Now the cream on top of that voluntary and gel. You talk about feeling better. Ooh wee. I feel so much better when I do it. I'm going to do it tonight. I'm, I'm thinking about it. I'm dreaming about it. I ain't even got there yet. But um, I rubbed that on and put that CBD cream on top and just sit there. Just sit there, you know. You can put your clothes on and you got out. I like it. And then um, relax. Don't think about nothing. Maybe take your medicine. Just sit down and relax. Honey, I said by half an hour later, you be feeling like a, I'm a brand new bitch. Brand new bitch. So, <laughs> I just want you to know. If you were having problems with volunteer in jail, this is how you make it work. This is how you make it work for a chronic person. Volunteer in jail is made with diclofenac. Diclofenac. I'm not supposed to use this. Because I'm allergic to aspirin. I'm not supposed to use it at all. And maybe that's why it worked for me sometime and it don't. But the benefits that I get out of it when it works for certain types of arthritis is well worth me chancing. I'm not saying for you to chance. I'm telling you what I do. Because me, I'm not going to be in pain for nobody. So... <clears throat> I don't know what to tell you. I'm just sharing what I do to help the pain go away. 
But I didn't find anything negative about it. It hasn't broke it hasn't broke me out or anything. I think that sometimes we go through so much pains in our life, especially when we get older, that most people don't know the difference between their pains. I know my pains. I have excruciating pain that keeps me up all night. I have pain that just makes me want to cut my knees off sometime, and I had that minor pain. This is great for that minor pain. So if you've ever tried Volatarian Gel, or even thought about trying Volatarian Gel, check it out. See if you like it. Now, I do know at one time, like I said, at one time, it was covered by Medicaid. If you have Medicare, it's not covered by that either. But what it is covered by is your over-the-health counter benefit if you're on Medicaid. This is one of the things I get out of that $105 total. So, hey. Or you might want to try the Walgreens brand. They got one, too. I don't know how that works. I only know about this. But, um, I just want to share with you what I do for my pay. Until next time.